side and the, the, second the, the, the Second Republic. Mm -hmm. and, you know, you know, you know. So, so this idea of was uh, rotten and bad. And bad. Is a, let us let us we can do the power of language. Yeah. Let us see how <laughs> we can use it. The newspaper had an headline yesterday trying to play up that issue mm. and turn it turn it the other way. And you know, Tinubu has come to say, well. You need to understand English. You, you editors, you, say, you editors to, to understand the nuances of language. <laughs> now, the, the point there is, be, besides all of this, like you mentioned earlier, mm. the issue of how, how high you raise your hand or how you tweak your face or yeah. who you stand with or yeah. who you snap with or yeah. who you visit, yeah. all of... But I wonder why all of those things matter at the time of campaigns. As as it, matters, it matters the time of campaign because you want to get into the essence of who the candidate mm. is. You also want to fish for errors. You want to, you want to, <laughs> you want to be contrarian. You want to be cynical. It's a period of cynicism and also a time of approbation. Oh, yeah. You want to be cynical. You want to say, well, why is, why is he frowning in the face? Mm -hmm. when, he looked, when he talked to the other person, mm -hmm. and what was he doing? Like when Tinubu was seen in the in this video talk, talk, touching uh, uh, articles, uh, um, PDP sign. Mm. So people want to know what was he saying? Exactly. Why did he put his finger? He's trying yeah. to say, look, this man, you have to endorse me. Oh, this man, you have moved to PDP. <laughs> you have gone to PDP. You know you were with me before. <laughs> eh? You have moved to PDP now. Eh? What are you doing? What are you doing with the umbrella? You know things like that. Things like that. Um, uh, they make politics interesting. Mm. But politics is not only about, uh, you know, want of free education, want, want to free uh, people from poverty. Yeah. But it's also uh, theater. No, it's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's, 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 it's beautiful. Now, yes. the point there is, but beyond all of that, what we see in the, in the new wave of social media mm. is, is the issue of fake news, yeah. misinformation, disinformation, and even hate speech yes. to a great extent. Yes, because yes. When, when we, for instance, the, the statement credited to uh, the PDP presidential candidates mm. where he was uh, uh, quoted as saying, uh, mm. uh, you know, they shouldn't vote for oh, an Igbo, a Yoruba person, you know, and all of that. All of, uh, of course, we'll have time to talk about that, but yes. uh, all, all of those things are things that uh, we get to see during the campaigns Yeah, we, well. we get to see things like that. Those are statements that should not be made because the last statement he made actually was uh, against um, was against uh, the electoral law mm. in, and, and it's also against decency politics. Mm. In a situation where the country is, uh, is, uh, is trying to pull out of uh, bigotry, yeah. trying to pull out of ethnic uh, chauvinism, mm. uh, it is not good for somebody who calls himself a role model to utter a statement close to that. He has not even apologized for it. Mm. In fact, I discovered that uh, uh, yesterday, some people in the party are looking for a way to walk out of it. But the thing is that it's already on video. Mm. It's already out. It's already out. And seen it. Yeah. 